It was very loud. Well, I'll keep an eye on things, and if anyone else asks, I'll get them admitted. Okay, sounds great. All right, guys, we are going to get started. Um, we are going to start with a little bit of strength. Fire up the core. You're welcome. Um, so, fine. You can do this. There's lots of modifications I'll offer, but we're going to do a little bit of planks because warms up the whole body all at once. Um, so, we've got about a minute and a half. We're gonna shift through some head plates, hold some planks. Just make sure we're uh, using our core so that we can use it throughout class. So let's see, are we on the speaker? No. Heels down, up, down, 
numbers are low sevens. Ten. Two. And Point, 
close. And you can use your arm if you'd like. Tandu front and plie. Your quality of movement changes. Out and plie. Back and plie. Side plie. We roll away. Cross. Music will start and we'll do the second five. Let me uh, give you a little of the timing. So it goes out, in, out, flex, point, in. Yes? So you're telling you plie, just go like this. Tongue you out and plie. Barely straighten it before you go to the next thing. Here we go. Six. Out. In. Out. Plus. Point. Stop. In. Out. Plus. Point. Back. Tendu, 
Tanlie, close back. Tan, Tanlie, close front. Tan, Tanlie, close back. Tan, Tanlie, close back. Tan, Tanlie, close front. Tan, Tanlie, close back. Side, Tanlie, close front. Side, Tanlie, close front. We'll play it out to Susu. If there's time for a balance, we'll hang out here. We might pick up the front foot. We'll see how that goes. Then we'll turn to our second set. Um, in your tonglies, be sure that you actually hit that plie in a real fourth position, not a lunge or a lean. Same thing with the side. And ideally, Right, when we shift legs from the front to the back, there's not a lot of movement forward and back. Because the first and last thing you do when you're telling you is shift your weight. Here we go. Six, seven,
YouTube on my playlist, but I got it the other now. Um, so Tagus and Degajes combined, um, still with a little bit of weight shifting. So we do Tanyu and two, three, and four, five, six, seven, hold it. Tanyu and two, and three, Degajes. Tanyu, Tanyu, and three, Degajes. Reverse, tandu, and two, and three, better, quicker, tandu, and two, and a one, two, three, tandu, and two, and a one, two, three. Part A. Part B, arm can stay, or you can use it. We take a to the front, one, two, plie, three, relevé, four, stay, five, Six, two, two, seven, lower eight. Big J back. Two, plie three, relevé four. Stay, stay, two, two, lower down. Side, two, plie up. Stay, 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 and let go. Then we'll cross, turn to the other side. So starting to build up strength on that standing leg. Remember, degaches do not come off the floor super high. They come up as high as the toes push, which is about two inches. Let's listen real quick because you know I like to play with time. It goes like this. Thank you. 
got real excited. I wanted to go faster than we were supposed to. Sorry. <laughs> I'm in the mood for shifting weight and becoming aware of two feet down in your positions. So what we do Yes. Again, you can use your arm or not. We do two that are slower. One, two, four that are quicker. One, two, three. Four, back, two, one, two, three, four, side, two, one, two, three, four, please out to the front, please out to the back, please out away from the bar, please out to the bar, passe, close back, passe, close front, passe, and stay forever until the music ends. Other side. So you fit the second half of each uh, direction. You fit four dégagés in the same amount of time as you did two dégagés first. Here we go. <laughs> One, two, one, two, three, four, back. You might just do three, two, two. Lift up, lift up, lift up, lift up. Lie, passe, up, and down, up, down, back. Three. Hip down. Finish. Other side. Here we go. One, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. into some round de jambes. Remember round de jambe means rounding of the leg. You're making a full circle in your bottom socket joint of your hip, that half circle on the floor. We prepare, stay in fifth, arm just moves, and eight. We do five, one, and around. Two and around. Four, you can use your arm if you like. Two, three, four. Repeat down and around. And two and around. Use your arm or keep it in second position. Reverse down and around. Down and around. Arm can go and six, seven, and eight. It goes down twice through. I think I've only done it once. Four. 
then then we brush the leg it can be at 45 it can be at 90 however high you like we brush it front Passe. Side. Passe. Back. Passe. Slide down the leg. To the back. Lift the knee. To the side. Passe. To the front. Passe. Down the leg. Chasse to the bar. Big long lunge, heel comes down, palm right up and back. Then we'll swoop it around. Take that palm in forward fold, no weight in that foot. And up, palm right again. Then you can angle a little bit if you'd like. And you get to an attitude. It could be low, it could be high. Find your balance. You can finish it out. And we'll go to our second side. What's most important here is the turnout exercise of the ronde jambe. So if you end up doing less ronde jambes, that's okay. But you want to be sure that you're doing good run jambes that hit all four positions. Here we go, left hand on the bar. Seven, eight, five, up, two, one, two. One, two, 
ready to do some releves, a goodly amount of them. So, I'll talk it through real quick facing you, but I'll do it with you facing my bar. We do eight plie releves. We hold, that's a lie, we do eight plie releves. Eight eleves, releves with no plie. Hold for eight counts, maybe 16. And lower our heels for eight counts. Then we switch to our right leg. We do eight plie releves in coupe. Hold for eight counts, switch sides. Eight plie releves on the left foot. Hold for eight counts, back to first. Four plie releves, two, three, four, hold for eight, lower for eight. Whether there is more music or not, we will then stretch our calves. You're welcome to follow along with the stretch I do or any other calf stretch um, that works well for you. Um, just be sure that you, when you have the plie, that you use the plie right? Your Achilles tendon needs that stretch in between every balance. Also, um, I refer to this muscle right here as the underbutt, because it's underbutt, yep. Um, and this is where your stability and your rotation comes from. So if you feel that engaging, you'll be on top of your legs. The lower that is super slow really helps you strengthen that particular muscle. Um, last week I was sore from, for days from our releve. Um, this week I expect it will also be days. You are welcome. So go ahead and face whatever you're using for your bar and we'll get started. Here we go. Down. Down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, down, up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, stay up, hold. Stay for another eight. Two to the left. Two. 
And then shake it out. Anything else you need, feel free. So just making sure our hips are nice and warm. Um, we're gonna do a combination I call my sevens. Um, I think if you've done class with me a couple times via Zoom, you did this at least once. If not, good news, I'm gonna talk us through it real quick. We're only gonna do one round today. Often we do multiple rounds. Um, height of leg is up to you. It's really just making sure that hip joint is nice and warm and loose. Cause you know, the other thing is probably from that ish. So, Arm will stay in second. We do seven swings. We do front, front, back, and three, four, five, six, seven. You're gonna take a quarter turn, close to fifth position front, facing your bar. Then we do seven, that swing side and across. Out and across. Four, five, six, seven. This time this leg closes fifth back, you make another quarter turn, you're ready for your second side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fifth front to your bar. Then out, cross. This should feel good. Seven, close back. Be sure the momentum is from the foot hitting the floor. When we're swinging front and back, it passes through first position. When you're saying it's swinging or cross, it kind of passes through fifth position. Again, height of the leg, your call. It's not about height, it's about movement and mobility of the hip joint. Here we go. alternate legs for this one. Yeah? <laughs> um, and we're going to only do the pointe one direction. Also, you're welcome. Um, so, nice, slow, gentle pay. Um, again, height, if you've got it, great. But don't sacrifice your technique and your turnout to get the leg higher. Um, in ballet, remember, we use the underneath 
of our leg, wrapping from the back and around to get our legs up versus other styles of dance or other workouts where you use your quads to lift the legs. The quads are still working, but they're not in charge. So, bend the pace. They're my least favorite. I used to go to the bathroom during dead pace for like the first 20 years of my life. So, we double pay one and two. Extend three, hold four. Plie on five, point it to arabesque. On six, hold seven, lower eight. We punch it forward and two. Come up three and four. Half a in and six. Leg down the leg seven and eight. Left leg goes and two. Extend three and four. Plie five. Up and around six. Stabilize seven, lower eight. Ponche one and two. Lift it up and two. Ponche in and two. Close fifth back to the side. Double pair one and two, three and four. Plie. Point it to the bar in attitude. Say through the eight. Plie. Releve. Three and four. Fondue. Pas de bourre. Other side. Coupe over. Double pay side. Two. Three. Four. Plie. Point to attitude, through the eight. Two plie relevant, and two. This time plie elongé, in, out, out, coupe over. We're not going to do the reverse. Yeah? Um, really think about your knee. Double pay to the front, your knees to the side and passe. It stays there as you extend. Your knee is still out in arabesque. Hanche, it hinges. It does not dive. It lifts up and forward from your hips. Yeah? Um, you can think your foot tips you over. You may not go very far, and that's okay. Here we go. Double pace. Six, seven, eight, one, two. Three, stay four. Plie, point in. Seven, flat, eight. Punche. Two, come up. Two, passe. Two, lower. Other side. One. Two. Three. Four. Three. Point it. Hold. Low. Hum shake. Two. Up. Two. Third 
on the right. Prevail. Second side. Last side. Three. Four. Plie. Add two. Six. And step. Plie. Thank you. 
You can touch your balance if you like. One. Last one. 
Lean forward. Then, if you took class last week, you know where you're headed. We're going to roll from here up to our right slip. So we roll toward that open space. Press up with your right hand and lift into your slip. If you feel sort of like a seal or a beached whale, I always do a little, no worries. Holding upright for a few more breaths. Make sure you have two hands on either side. Maybe you fold towards your front leg a little bit. Maybe. Hands can be in the air if you haven't had your full split. Last option before we roll back down, you can lean to the open side, really getting into that hip flexor of the back leg. You can come down to elbows. You can lay down if you like. Then we come back. Center on our split. And grab for that right foot with the right hand. Rolling back to your back. Releasing the leg. Readjust if you need. I'm going to turn around so I don't roll away from you. Hug your left knee in. This time your right hand reaches for the ankle, the calf, or the foot. Now we stretch the leg long. Left hand can come around the thigh. Fold. Bend. And stretch. Two. Stretch. Three. And stretch. Four. And stretch. Switching hand, your left hand replaces the right. The leg opens out to the side. Remembering that option for right hand on right hip. As we hold. Then, he presses back and stretch. Two, stretch. Up to a seat. 
We'll finish with a little bit of straddle stretch. Legs go out to your straddle. Really working on almost feeling like you're tipping your pel pelvis forward so that you're not rounding back like you've been punched in the stomach. We're just gonna walk our hands a little bit forward. We are eventually gonna go to our depth, but we got a while, so you may not wanna get there all the way at once. Maybe you get a little bit closer to the floor. Flex your feet. And one, two, three, and four. Then finding your depth. Maybe you lay all the way down. Maybe you stay where you were. Make sure you're breathing. And you can gently walk your hands back up. Using your hands or not, folding your knees in, taking that butterfly position. Maybe press the knees down, round it forward. And of course, you're welcome to take any additional stretches you need. Make sure you drink plenty of